Hello everyone, thanks for being with us. I'm Robert Olguin. Four local students are in the hospital after a serious crash near Jefferson High School. KFOX 14 News at 5's Harrison Parker, live in South Central El Paso with what we know about the crash and the injuries. Harrison. That's right, Robert. I'm here at the corner of Valverde and Paisano where that serious accident took place this morning. Now, I spoke with one witness who heard the crash. She came outside of her home, out front of the Dairy Queen. She saw the driver of the first car panicking about the condition of those students. She came over here to the corner where she saw two students, conscious, recovering from their injuries on the sidewalk as pedestrians and bystanders started flooding in. Now, over here was the second car. You can see some of the glass on the ground where the two other students were, including one that was pinned under the car and unconscious. Now, that witness said she saw several bystanders actually lift the car and get that girl out from under there. Now, three, all four were rushed to the hospital. Three are in moderate condition, but that one that was pinned under the car, she is actually in serious condition. Now, we don't know what exactly caused this accident. We're still waiting from deta for details from authorities, but I spoke with students at Jefferson High about what happened to their classmates. They were all quite shaken up. I've never seen anything like that. That's crazy. It really is crazy. Honestly, it was pretty sad, honestly, because um, I feel bad for the people that are not, uh, that are, uh, are like in the hospital right now. Um, I hope she's okay. And everybody's on their phones, and each everybody's telling each other, like, oh, hey, yeah, some girls got hit, somebody got chopped under the car, and it's just, like, very shocking. Authorities say a 911 call came in at 10.21 a.m. this morning as El Paso police shut the section of Paisano near Jefferson High School. El Paso Fire told us it responded to reports of people being run over on East Paisano Street and Valverde. EPISD confirmed that the four people injured are students at Jefferson Silva High School. One student said she's not surprised this sort of accident happened here at the school. I've been here for a bit. And a few times I've walked with my friends and we'll go whenever the lights like red. Cars will still go, they don't care. They will speed. And a few times cars will swerve over kids and almost hit them. And it's very scary because this happens a lot. Danica, a high schooler, says the city should have more cops here to monitor the area and change the light timing so kids don't put themselves in danger. So kids like they're rushing, they don't want to get tardies, you know. Sure. Well, the El Paso Police Department said they're still waiting for information from their investigators who are still coming through everything that happened. So they don't have any updates for us at the moment, but we will keep you posted as we learn more about this developing story. I'm Harrison Parker reporting from South Central El Paso, KFOX 14 News at 5.